Welcome again to BuyBrevard.com TV. I'm your host, Michael Gall, and with us today are Nancy and Stuart Borton from Yellow Dog Cafe. Good to have you folks with us today. Thanks for having Thank us. You. We want to talk with you folks today about what Yellow Dog Cafe has to offer to the Brevard County residents. And uh, let's start with uh, how long ago the whole cafe began. We opened 13 years ago, at least 13 years now. At that location. Yes, sir. Yes. Excellent. And tell me about what would be the entire experience, if you will, that people can expect when they come to the Yellow Dog Cafe. We do everything from trying to give the best food, best atmosphere, and best service. We've got a dynamic location, so we're pretty blessed there. But um, we, th we thrive really hard. Our staff goes to great lengths to prepare the food fresh every day. And our servers, again, go to great lengths to try to make your experience above and beyond. Well, I've ate there a number of times, and the service is outstanding. Thank you. I uh, always feel like I'm somebody special when I'm at Yellow Dog Cafe. What are some of the favorite items on the menu? Well, I'd have to say onion crusted chicken was one of the ones you brought on. It's <laughs> one of the best. That's, uh, that's been a favorite for a long, long time. Um, that, that, uh, for lunchtime, the, the fish cake is extremely popular. Um, we've got several dog-themed sandwiches that's a popular. We make our own hamburger buns. As a matter of fact, I, I got my baker's on vacation this week, so I was in there making hamburger buns this week, and uh, I forget how much time it actually takes to make those. <laughs> we brand them at the top, on top with a little uh, dog on the top, so it's kind of unique. Yeah, it's really artisan unique. bread every day. Sure. It's fun. Um, how did the name Yellow Dog come about? There's several stories. One, if you listen to our staff, created their own. <laughs> the real story. <laughs> Some dear friends of ours had a Yellow Dog, and they actually did a whole proposal to us using their Yellow Dog for all the, the promotional end of it. And they used a stick dog at the very end. And as soon as that stick dog came on, it reminded me where I'm from, Boston, and it was like a bar, uh, like a Bostonian kind of an animal, and it was just, he was just perfect. So I fell in love with the stick dog. And um, the folks that did it are from Vero Beach, and Blanche was the original dog, and we ran with it. There were some great ideas that came from that whole thing. Well, it's become a highly recognizable brand. You see the little yellow dog, you know <laughs> what we're talking about. With, with that original uh, design that we got, the marketing proposal we got from, the, from uh, Morton Sheila, our dear friends in Vero Beach, uh, we've taken that and taken and, and embellished that design that they gave us in the beginning and that's going to be actually featured throughout my cookbook. The whole marketing plan is actually going to be in that cookbook. They did things like hightail it to the Yellow Dog Cafe and they had a picture of two of their dogs with their tails in the air running up, running down the beach and come by land or sea and there was two, there are two dogs in the <laughs> beach or in the water um, swimming. Um, and, and escape and they had their dogs when they were babies mm -hmm. in a and it's just some crazy and we were we were rolling on the floor <laughs> laughing by the time we were done with this this pitch they were giving us and uh, it was just funny so then in, in the cookbook there's not going to be a lot of great recipes that we got coming out in the next couple of months uh, there's going to be also all this original art that we had uh, that we uh, originally was formulated to market the yellow dog with for, for over the years so we were putting a lot of that stuff in and kind of making a little story about that in there as well. So it's going to be a really unique. So you've kind of touched on that. You have a cookbook that's coming out? Coming out. It should be out. Uh, you know, I'm optimistic. Nancy says it's going to be another <laughs> it was going to six be months of last year, just so that you know. <laughs> but, but I'm thinking next week I'm going to be doing my final edit. So <laughs> I'd say July sometime. Sometime this summer. Maybe this we can summer. We're hoping for summer. July. Yeah. Well, the Yellow Dog Cafe has received a number of awards. I know that you folks personally participate in the community in a big way. You have some favorite charities that you're a major part of. You give a lot back to the community as well. What would be one thing that people could always expect when they come to Yellow Dog Cafe that they're going to take away? The beautiful, aside from the food and the service, the location, the yeah. river, I mean that's just something that was created without Stuart and I, but it's just the overall river, it's gorgeous, there's just nothing like it. And for people that haven't been fortunate enough to be there, where are you located at? We're kind of in between, I always say between Vero Beach and Melbourne, it's right on U.S. Highway 1, um, Malabar, Florida. Six and a half miles south of 192. There you go. <laughs> um, for the southern customers, uh, we're 10 miles north of the Sebastian River, Brevard County line. 
perfect yeah. between if you're coming up to the go to the King Center or anything that's happening in, in Brevard County and you're coming from the south. It's a perfect meeting place. Kind and of a new, you know, uh, excuse me, kind no. of a unique location because it takes somebody from Vero Beach the same amount of time to get there as it does somebody from from um, Vieira. Vieira. Yeah. It's about 25 minutes from both directions. So we have a, a, a very large draw base. For our and what would be a number for them to call if they want to make reservations? 321-956-3334. And they can visit you on the web where? Yellowdogcafe.com. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Thanks for being with us Thanks today. Thanks for having us. Thanks this is Nancy and Stuart Borden, owners of Yellow Dog Cafe. Be great to have them here with us on buybrevard.com TV. I hope you'll tune in again next time. Thanks now.